Hello, and welcome to Too Much Robert Partridge, the vlog, episode two. I thought I'd never see the day. I'd like to start off this episode with a sentimental acoustic ditty, aka a sad. Um, cue the rain. When I found out it is uh, Fab Morvan of Millie Vanilli, who's still alive, and I have no clue if that's Millie or Vanilli, so... Kind of where I was last week on that one. But uh, anyway, uh, blame it on the rain. This song's called Gas Is My Specialty. I wrote it about 10 years ago. And based on the lyrics, I should have written it 25 years ago. It goes like this. Gas is my specialty. Come on over and you can see. I'll be ready. Did you see the Saved by the Bell reunion? Wow. Just wow. Now it's time for a segment called... But did you notice that? No, that, that's, that's also not a segment. You may remember this segment from last week. It's called, uh, What Happened to Me? I, I used to do big things. I, I once got props from Andy Milanakis for covering his song, Let Me Twitter That, right when Twitter hit. And uh, we didn't even know to call it tweets back then, but he was uh, a pioneer, and uh, he, he liked my version. Let me Twitter that, circa 09, July 09. I used to tweet from behind, when I'm rolling to the club on when the in the but now now I uh, occasionally drive kids to school I didn't plan for this segment very well this week but uh, there's a lot not happening that's the drift on that did you see the Save by the Bell reunion? Now I try to run marathons. Remember last week? Today is day 37 of 147, marathon training. I ran a 10K, which is 6.2 miles at a 744 pace, which I think is probably the best run I've ever done, maybe, pace-wise. Pound for pound, uh, ounce for ounce, uh, centigrade by uh, uh, Celsius. I noticed I had a bit of a, a protruding patella, which needs to be my new metal band, by the way. Um, protruding patella. And uh, so it worried me a little bit. It was kind of bulging out, it was, it was swollen. And I hope I'm just not gonna pop that bone out of its socket, uh, or at least save it until the marathon, climactic. But seriously, did you see the Saved by the Bell reunion? My God. Just perfect. It was perfect. Uh, Nameless Legend Records update. I introduced you to all the, uh, the folks on there last week. Um, except for, of course, the one that's active. Uh, my pop punk band, That Away. Yet to not know. Kind of like this one. Um, <laughs> of course, I don't have it down. Uh, I'll, I'll throw it in here. I'm going to pretend like I'm listening to it right now. I went numb when you said it was over And I've never really felt the same When the feeling did come back Seemed rooted in another brain Still what I had to embody Still what I had to embrace But now I feel a little less in somebody A new person I got a train Running bad at this life without you Oh, 
know, speaking of Saved by the Bell, you see the reunion? But after the reunion came on, you know, uh, Esquire magazine actually found the uh, film Saved by the Belding, which I was lucky enough to have my uh, Rod Belding portrait in. It's right here. I can probably take it off the wall. Do you know you are beautiful? There has nobody ever told you so. And uh, allegedly, Rod Belding himself, Ed Blatchford, IRL, said he wanted that portrait in the film. That he wouldn't be in it unless that was in it. I might be paraphrasing at this point, but uh, it was really cool to be featured in a film with Rod Belding and some other special guests that you will see when you check out Safe by the Belding. But uh, Esquire magazine online picked it up. And uh, yeah, Rod Belding, cool dude. That wasn't in the Jimmy Fallon reunion, but uh, he was in this 2010 reunion that I, I got to be a part of, kind of. So that was cool. And it's my buddies at Saved by the Empire Productions. Uh, Scott Hamilton, not the ice skater and company. Uh, cool dudes. And it's a really, it's a touching film. It's really funny, but it's also got a lot of heart. What more can you ask for? Um, except a little more rod. Came out wrong. What's on the docket? All right, I auditioned for a, a voiceover gig. Pretend I'm listening to it now. San Diego is a phenomenal city. The warm Southern California climate, paired with over 70 miles of beautiful coastline, attracts visitors from all over the world. As a diverse region set against blue skies, soft sandy beaches, and friendly people, it's no wonder San Diego is America's finest. Wouldn't that be cool if I timed that perfectly? Pretending I just heard it right then? I mean, listening to it right then? Yeah. The Grammys. Uh, those are fun or something uh yeah uh i think uh by far the best duo of the night was uh kevin nealon and annie lennox go back and watch it you'll see what i'm talking about look look at who's tickling those ivories that, that's uh that's kevin nealon but uh no annie lennox was awesome mano y mano she's the best singer out there i think and a sincere congrats to tom petty for having the best song of the year uh to have stolen way to send a message out to the world grammys that uh all you gotta do is copy a great classic Tom Petty song and, um, and you'll win. Maybe next year it'll be uh, Kelly Clarkson stealing Jimmy World's The Middle. Fingers crossed. The Middle is an awesome song. And, you know, Jimmy World will probably be up for something and lose. But, uh, yeah, go back and listen to that Tom Petty song. It's, uh, it's good. How about that Saved by the Bell reunion? Man. Two shorts, 19,999. Listen to it now. Uh, if you're over uh, probably 25, that's pretty dirty. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cover the, that thing, music video style, soon. So, I'll, I'll try to be busier next week. Okay, see you next time. Bye. Just woke up. Hey, let me Twitter, Dad. Ah. Hey, let me Twitter, Dad. Take a hot shower. Hey, let me Twitter, Dad. Let me go downstairs. Hey, let me Twitter.